when they pushed the car up on stage and it caught fire. This is the car. This is from the William E. Swigert uh, Junior Automobile Museum in Huntington, Pennsylvania, winner of the Best American Post-War Car Award. This is Pat Swigert's 1947 Tucker Tin Goose four-door sedan prototype. It was called the Tin Goose because the car was basically filled with so much lead and so much metal on the car uh, to try and sculpt it and get it ready so that Preston Tucker actually had an automobile to show to the public. This car uh, was uh, used for promotional purposes across the United States. It has the distinction of being the fifth automobile recorded under the Secretary of Interior Standards for Historic Documentation, and it is on the National Register. Uh, it has been part of the Swagger Collection for many years, but the car had not run in probably about 50 years. Uh, in the back, you can see Adam. Adam is one of the students from Penn College of Technology who took on the project of getting this car ready, running, and roadworthy for Pebble Beach, California, Illinois, last year, where the Tucker automobile was featured. This is a very, very important car, and I will point out to you, you are within 100 miles of five Tuckers, two at the Swigert Museum, three at the AACA Museum, and of the 51 cars produced, 47 still exist. So it's a wonderful, wonderful car, and we're so glad to have this car here. Thank you, folks. Pat, congratulations on receiving the Olympus Award as well. Okay, this is the winner of the Society of Automotive Historians Award, given by Lou Miller.